that we take beer very seriously here and we were very attentive to that before. Uh, I think the Cicerone exam was something that Sam and I more so were taking just to see if we could do it to, to prove to ourselves. And also it is something nice to be able to advertise and, and to give weight to Meridian Pint. This is a safe place to come. Uh, not, not a safe place, but this is a great place to come and drink beer. You're not going to have dirty lines. You're going to have a knowledgeable staff. We don't carry uh, Budweiser, PBR, Miller, or any of that stuff. And when people want a beer like that, it's important that we know what, uh, what the best craft alternative is. Uh, when you're pairing dessert, you're going to want the beer really to be above 7%. Uh, it's a rule of thumb, but you're going to want a big beer. And you want the beer to be at least as sweet as the dessert in general. It's a, a brewery out of Michigan called Jolly Pumpkin. And all the beers that he makes are not necessarily pumpkin beers, but they're they're all soured in oak barrels that he keeps in the, in the brewery. This is a little bit confusing because this is actually his pumpkin beer. So all year we have to tell customers that Jolly Pumpkin is not really a pumpkin beer, and then they get used to it, and then by the end of the year, this beer comes out and it actually is his pumpkin beer. I think the important thing is not to carry a beer just because the name that it has, but to carry something that's really a quality product. Sometimes our customers are surprised when they come in and they don't see what they're, what they're used to seeing, but over time they realize that they're getting a great product. My favorite DC brew would probably be the DC Brow Corruption. I am kind of a hophead. You're missing out on, on a lot of stuff, and, and that's fine. You know, different strokes for different folks, and they each their own, but I have a ton of fun with it. I love it. This is my job, and, you know, if ever you want to come in and hang out and nerd out a little bit, I'm more than happy to do that. If you just want to drink a beer and not think twice about it, it's totally cool, too.